So today we're going to be going over my EDC. These are the items that I carry with me every day and I don't leave the house without them. So first off, phone, Apple iPhone. It's an XS Max. Typically with my phones and my watches, I upgrade to the newest model every year, but up until recently, I haven't really found the need to do so. So I don't like to have a lot of things on me. So the cool thing about my phone is that it's also my wallet. Um, I have it in this Incipio case. Um, and if you slide it back right here, it's got room for three credit cards, but I managed to sneak four in there. Um, I have my concealed license, my driver's license, my main debit card, and my credit card in there. I think that's really cool and efficient. I just put this in my front pocket and we're good to go. Next up, watch. Because I have an Apple iPhone, I use an Apple watch. Um, I've had the Apple watch ever since the first one came out. This is a series five. And ever since I've been using an Apple watch, I've never really needed or wanted to go back to a standard analog or you know your typical type of watch. The Apple watch is a huge convenience to me. It serves a bunch of apps and it gives me all my notifications from my phone. So I don't have to pull it out every single minute. So that's really cool. Next, we have keys. Now I have a couple cars, uh, but this is my everyday car. This is my key fob. I have the key right in there. I have my house key and I have my garage key. The other thing that I have on my key fob is this Gerber shard. I keep this thing with me and I take it everywhere I go. I can't tell you how many times I've used this. I can't tell you how many beers I've opened up with this thing. The flathead, I've used it in multiple occasions to help me out of a tight spot or if I'm trying to nudge something out or something like that. And this Phillips head screwdriver has saved me in the most dire of times. So I love this thing. I keep it on every set of keys that I have and it's really convenient. Now, the fun stuff. Because I am in Florida and I have a concealed weapons permit, I can conceal my weapons. Um, and those weapons consist of a small carry knife and a pistol of choice. Now, uh, I'm gonna go over the knives first. Nothing special. The first one is a Tac Force Speedster model. Nothing special. This is just a $20 knife off of Amazon. Um, I love it, keep it sharp. I used to open packages and daily activities such as that. The other knife is a Smith & Wesson Extreme Ops knife. Again, just a little carry knife, open packages and stuff like that. Really comes in handy. Now, firearms, this is the fun part. Um, I'm not gonna go over the specs on these. That's what Google's for. I'm just telling you what I use and what's convenient for me. Um, first up is going to be the Glock 43. Um, I carry this in a standard carbon fiber Kydex holder. And we're gonna safety check this. This is the Glock 43. Nothing done to it. It is an absolute stock body. The only thing I have done to it, um, to the magazine, is a Hive Plus 2 extension. Um, and my ammunition of choice is a Spear Gold Dot. It's a hollow point. And with that extension, you can see it creates a nice purchase and makes it really comfortable to use and hold. My second firearm of choice is going to be the Glock 27. I carry this in a Dara Holsters holster, just a standard Kydex. Uh, we're going to safety check this one as well. Now, the only thing done to this, I've added a TLR6, which is a light and a laser. Nothing else done to it. Um, and as far as the magazine, it is a Glock 22 magazine, which is an extension compared to the Glock 27 magazine. Um, and I have an X grip in here just to make it more comfortable. So you put that in there, it gives you a nice purchase as well. Now this is a bit bigger um, and I tend to use this as my home defense gun. Uh, but sometimes when I have, you know, when I have jeans on or something like that, something a little bit baggier, um, I like to take the 40 out. So that's pretty much it. That is my EDC. Um, I tend, like I said, I rotate the pistol and the knives, but for the most part, I take out the 43 and the Smith & Wesson every day. It goes with me everywhere. If you guys have any questions about anything, please leave a comment down below. I'm really trying to build this channel up, so if you could subscribe, I'd really appreciate that. But that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.